All right, so this is a continuation for a video I did recently about the importance of looking at composite numbers. The inspiration, again, came from someone who called into Zachary K. Hubbard's show and said, you always looking at prime relationships. What about composite numbers? So the idea here is, you look at a composite numbers chart and see, pick out a composite number and find out where it falls in the chart. Starting with Scamatria. The Hebrew word for moon has a value of 218. 218 is a composite number. And if you look at the composite numbers chart, see where it falls. 218 is the 170th composite number, and it just so happens in a different cipher of gematria, using English letters, the word moon has a value of 170. Now, before people were using gematrinator.com, there was gematrix.org. It, it still exists. And that same cipher that Derek has labeled Latin or Agrippa, that is still called Hebrew in that gematrix.org. There's at least one other calculator that calls it Jewish. I see why Derek changed the name, because we're using English letters, but, look, I mean, just look at the comparison here. Moon in Hebrew letters equals 218, and 218 is the 170th, composite number, and moon, with English letters, the Latin, Agrippa, or Jewish cipher, equals 170. I don't see many people talking about this type of comparison, so I'll keep it there, real simple like that. 